Hey Aquarius, this is your sacred scribe here, ready to do your reading. So this is going to be a reading for my Aquas, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Jupiter, and North Node. This will not resonate with everybody, of course, but hopefully it will with you. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe right down below there, Aquarius, if you would before you leave. I do appreciate it. And thank you so much for all of your likes, shares, and subscriptions. If you guys are interested in a personal reading, that way this is more specific to you and your questions and your needs, information can be found in the description box below. Make sure that you're utilizing the link in the description box, Aquarius, if you are interested, as there are scammers about the community. And know that you will always see my face in a reading if you order one from me, as well as receive an unlisted link that you can utilize forever here on YouTube. Don't forget to comment. I want to hear from you guys and hit that notification bell. That way you get notified whenever I upload a video or go live. All right, so Aquarius, your overall energy is the Justice card, and your challenge is the Heart of Cups here. You also have the Spirit of Cups, the Hanged Man, the Four of Swords, and the Sky Father, which is the Emperor. <clears throat> hmm. So there is at least one decision that's needing to be made here. It may have to do with this emperor. It could be, and, and this emperor could be somebody actually from the past that you healed over and you're not communicating with right now. Could be Aries, Taurus, or any sign really. Your, okay, your challenge is keeping your heart open. As they just said, keeping your heart open. So I'm not sure, well, they have to be coming back. This emperor is coming back then. It's somebody that you haven't communicated with. So whether or not you had a relationship with them, I, I do feel that you did. I don't know, maybe you didn't, maybe it never got off the ground or something. But this is coming back around and you're looking at this a little bit differently nonetheless you're needing to make a decision so let's see tell me about the justice tell me about this decision yeah three of cups reunion so you're gonna have to decide whether or not you're gonna reunite with this individual the fool you're gonna take a leap of faith towards this individual you're gonna give this another shot Tell me. Okay, Four of Pentacles. All right, when I said tell me, I heard if you need someone to talk to, then they started playing that song. I think it's, uh, it's from a long time ago. Call me. I think it was call me if you need someone to talk to. Don't know if that means anything to you uh maybe th they message you and say that i don't know but this person or maybe it's you because the four of pentacles is here maybe you haven't let go of them okay you have the universe here too so this is talking about a new beginning you may be entertaining this this may be what you want this reunion yeah, I feel there's an excitement in this great fortune that I'm feeling. This yellow is standing out. Which is your life force energy, right? Your solar plexus. And I feel that you feel that your life force is greater with this person. Just know Aquarius that you do not need anybody else to make you stronger so you may want to you may want to look at that I'm not saying it's wrong it's what you feel 
but why? I'm just curious as to why. Okay, I do feel you are excited though. You are making the decision. You're thinking about it. You're not jumping into it. But I do feel you're going to take that leap of faith. You, you do have the fool here. So why is your challenge keeping your heart open? There had to have been some hurt here. Two of Pentacles. There's somebody else in the picture when this person comes back. I don't know. Six of Cups. That's this person. What else? Yeah, Three of Swords. I knew there was hurt. So there could be also three people right now. But there may have been a third party involved, and this is why it broke up. So this is why, you know, even if there isn't a third person involved here right now for you to make this decision, this is weighing on your mind about this individual. And this is why the Two of Pentacles is here. Yeah, you have despair and message of concern. You're concerned that this person maybe hasn't changed and that you'll get your heart broken again. Even, even though you've got this excitement over here, there's this concern in the back of your mind, in the back of your heart, because it's not allowing you to keep that heart open. It's opening, it's closing, it's opening, it's closing because of this back and forth energy, like with this two of pentacles, right? Tell me about the spirit of cups. Earth mother. So that's the empress. So you may see this person as your divine counterpart here. That's why you feel, okay, and temperance and the innocence of pentacles. That may be why you feel that you're stronger with this person because they're your divine counterpart. Could even be your twin flame. That, that would make sense. But even still, know that you have all the power that you need within you. Okay, yes, with twin flames together, you are stronger because you make that third energy, okay, that can have a major impact on the world. So that may be what you're feeling if it is a twin. You are trying to balance your masculine and feminine energies because I do see and feel that you want to be whole within if you decide to come together again with this individual, you yourself want to be whole. You yourself want to be, you know, this empress. Um, whatever you touch turns to gold, basically. That's what an empress is. And the innocence of pentacles, you want to offer them something. But I do feel if you do, you're going to go slow because of this heartbreak. main male so they're quite on your mind here so let's see what the hangman is the lovers ten of wands yeah talk about weighing on your mind it's weighing you down you have to make a decision three of wands it's what you've been waiting for it's what you've been waiting for and again we have the three so don't know if two people are showing up it's really the emperor that's prominent here. So if there is, I'm not so sure you're really giving them um, that much of a time of day here. Tell me about the four of swords, the movement of cups. Okay, so you know that your heart needs to be healed. You know that you need to heal in order for your heart to remain open. Yeah, two of swords. That's being stuck. That's a blocked hot chakra. And this is what you're healing. But you're aware of this, the Wheel of Fortune. That's what's going to get things moving. Okay. Let me get a kipper over here. Yep, that's the decision. And then a message. You're getting a message from this person. Either getting one or sending one. One or the other. I am getting that you're getting one. But, uh, like I said, take it how it resonates. Tell me about Skyfather. The High Priestess. This could be a twin. You have Justice and the High Priestess here. And the Emperor and Empress. So, Spirit of Swords. 
This person is very intuitive. The tower. Oh yeah, they're, they're, I, that's why I felt that they're going to message you. So it's going to be quite surprising them returning. All right, you, they may keep, you both may keep this secret, but I am feeling that there's an intuition, there's, there's a connection here, intuitive connection. They could actually be waking up to this. Because what I'm feeling is that they knew that there was a connection before. Now they understand it more deeply because they may have went through an awakening here. They may be uh, communicating with spirit on a deeper level. And they may come in and tell you this. Ah, false person. What they're going to tell you is that they haven't been authentic. They haven't been truly who they were meant to be. Because if this is a twin flame relationship, then, you know, stepping into their power has something to do with spirituality. Okay. And I don't feel that this emperor or empress, it could be somebody just in their masculine energy has been living in their authenticity. And they really didn't get that until, until, until this happens. They don't get that. So they're going to, they're going to let you know that, oh my God, you know, I've been wearing a mask all this time and I didn't even fully understand it. And I feel that you tried to tell this person before, but you know, when you're not awakened, you can't, you can't make somebody understand what you're, what you're trying to convey. And it's not wrong. Being awakened, unawakened, one's not wrong, one's not right. It just is. It's the experience, right? The hermit. They go into hermit mode, and this is when they have that awakening. So they're coming back with a hell of an understanding of their soul. That's for sure. And they're going to let you know exactly what they've learned. Advice, Aquarius. Happy accident. Fortunate accidents can act as guides to edit and be open to where you should go next okay so pay attention to happy accidents here all right aquarius i hope that resonates please drop a like below share and subscribe if you already haven't if you're interested in a personal reading that way this is more specific to you and your questions and your needs information can be found in the description box below make sure that you're utilizing the link in the description box if you are interested aquarius that way you can be brought to my etsy shop where you're supposed to go and if you order a reading from me know that you will always see my face as well as receive an unlisted link that you can utilize forever here on youtube don't forget to comment. I want to hear from you guys and hit that notification bell. That way you get notified whenever I upload a video or go live. Have a fabulous day and I will catch you on the flip side on the dailies. Namaste.